18 thing. Yeah. You know, you know. How you doing, ladies and gentlemen? Your boy OB with a wit television. How you doing today, tonight, and morning, guys? Side watch video. So we had a great, 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 great game Sunday. I'm not gonna say keep saying great. Like we already knew what we had. We already knew what we was gonna do. You know, the victory Monday. I'm gonna drop the video on Tuesday. Well, you know, I might drop it today. But you know, it's for Tuesday. But I might drop it today. It's a little late, but we had a great game. Um, Brandon Ayuk showed who he is. He's BA. Bring what's a good what's a good A word? Bring assets. We can say something like that. Bring something. Because <laughs> y'all gonna need help when y'all play him. Y'all definitely gonna need help. Um shout out to Patrick Peterson. I wanna say you the reason why that game went that way, because you trash talk all the way up to the game and you disappeared. Uh couldn't find you. We didn't know where you was at. I forgot you even played for Pittsburgh. Fitzpatrick didn't hear you either. I know you ain't talk trash, but that's the only person I know on the defense other than, than TJ Watt, which dismantled our uh, right tackle. We ain't going to say no names. Uh, but we weathered the storm and got the victory. Shout out to Chris McCaffrey for doing what he do. Shout out to Brock Purdy for silencing the haters. Shout out to the defense for showing us why we the number one defense in the league. Shout out Drake Jackson for going out there balling like he should. Shout out Hargrave. He went out there and got a sack, too. And shout out both for being there as well. Fred, wonderful. Shout out everybody on the defense. Shout out the whole team. I'm super excited for that victory going 1-0. You know, it was a lot quieter at work, and I appreciate that. Um, but I ain't going to stick too long on this video. I mean, I said this video. On that game, it's on to the next. We got to play the L.A. Rams. Um, I think this could be a game for us to really tweak some more. You know, especially dealing with our, our, our old line situation, just tweak it up a little bit, get some more gadget plays going, and get plays out. Oh, shout out Moody too. Three for three field goals. Uh, but yeah, we gotta figure some things out, like as far as just you know, just, just just touch up a little bit more on the offensive end. I don't think this is gonna be a struggle game playing the uh, the Rams. They did beat the Seahawks, which I thought the Seahawks were gonna win that game, but Seahawks, Seahawks. Uh, but we're going against the Rams. Um, I want to see. I want to see how Kittle. Kittle usually gets off on the, on the Rams and Debo. Um, I want to see that 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 BA and 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 Brock Purdy connection continues because uh, I'd be sighting to see. Um, but I, I do want to see. Like I want to highlight the offensive line this game. I mean they got uh, Aaron Donald in the middle, so I want to highlight the offensive line. I want to see if you guys can hold your weight. I mean T.J. Watt was crazy. I get it, but you know Aaron Donald plays the middle, so we got to figure things out. Um, on the defensive end, I want to see a little bit more Kinlaw. Kinlaw had a, a, a silent game, uh, decent silent game, but I want to see how he handled himself. Uh, those are two things I really want to see from this game, man. Um, like I said, playing Rams on the road early. You know, we got to prepare ourselves to get, you know, get this roll, get, get this get this thing rolling, man. Um, but yeah, I'm excited for that that, that victory against. Uh, the Pittsburgh Steelers. Like I said, we're back on the Rams. So, yeah, I, I got us winning this game. Um, I think, like I said, I think it's going to be one of them games that, you know, we just go out there and ball. You know, I, and I think that we're going to get on the road early, jump on them early, get this, get this junk situated. Uh, I, I do want to work on, you know, like I said, I want to see more Debo, um, too, as well. I know I ain't say that. I want to see, you know, get Debo more involved as well, but. When you throwing the ball and Brandon I, you playing like that, you might not need to throw Debo the ball. And I understand that. I, I totally understand that. But I want to see more of them guys. To, I, to be honest with you, I want to see the same copy and paste. Get in, get out. Uh, I want to be able to see Sam Donald in the fourth quarter and beginning of the fourth quarter. That's how I want that game to go. Uh, but like I said, I'm not going to sit and hold you guys too long. Uh, but be prepared to see another good game. Uh, get ready for the Rams. Uh, like I said, I got us winning that game. Um, if you got fantasy, I would definitely, definitely, definitely 100% put um, Kittle. Put Kittle up there. McCaffrey. Brandon Ayuk. Debo. Put the whole put the whole starting offense on, on your uh, fantasy because it's going to be a good game. Like I said, I don't, 
only person I can think of on the Rams. And like I said, it's not taken away from the Rams, but the only thing I can see on that team is Aaron Donald. And um, that's it. Because um, Bobby Wagner left. He went to Seattle. So the only person I can see on that team on the defense end is Aaron Donald that we got to deal with and Tyler Higby. And I love Tyler Higby because for some reason he just get off on us. I don't, I don't understand that. That's how I know the whole name, Tyler Higby. I know Higby is because of that. Um, but, yeah, like I said, I got us winning that game. Um, I'm excited. Y'all get ready for this game, man. It's, it's going to be exciting, man. I can't wait. Um, like I said, I'm not going to sit here and hold you guys up too long. Um, oh, we had one injury with um, Avery Thomas, but he cleared concussion protocol before the game was over. So we had we didn't have no injury to report. Um, but, yeah, I want to see how Brock Purdy hurt himself up against the division rivals. Um, I think he going to hold his weight. He did good last year. So I, I think he going to hold his weight. Um, like I'm excited, man. I'm super excited. So yeah, I'm not gonna hold you guys. This is from a new subscriber, old subscriber, my favorite subscribers. Uh, I'm about to say leave your name, number, message. <laughs> but like, share, comment, and subscribe all of the above because you truly, truly appreciate it. I appreciate you guys, man. And I got some haters. I ain't gonna say haters. I got some fans on other teams posting, you know, giving their response to things. I love that. I love seeing that. Post more. Uh, yeah, so we'll have a nice little conversation after the game, man, or before the game. I like I like interacting with people. Uh, it's, it's, it's enjoyable. I'm going to make sure I don't care from I have one subscriber to a million subscribers. I'm always going to try my best to respond to everyone, you know. So, like I said, I enjoy it. I enjoy it. And I enjoy it. Uh, but y'all enjoy the rest of y'all day. And like I said, get ready for these Rams on Sunday. I mean, we go game by game, brick by brick. All gas, no breaks. Y'all have a good one. They try to play you down, you won't laugh They try to throw dirt in your name, scratch your frame with their hands at you